All right, back with Far Cry 5. Let's get it. I wish, bro. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, look at her. Son of a You did it! You did it, thank you! Bro, dick. Jim! The play's back! Yeah, I know. Hey, come on, let's turn her around. Come on, grab on. <laughs> you know, this is the first time in a long time. I feel like shit's actually going my way. Those damn piggies. Jim, come on! Please tell me they didn't. You know, this plane's been in my family for three generations. Do you believe that? Jim, you coming? Yeah, I'm coming! I swear, that woman's so dumb. Anyway. My grandpa first got it when he got back from World War II. It was his pride and joy. I made a few modifications over the years. Jim, would you just hurry up? What? Those motherfuckers just won't let up. For real. Jesus Christ. Listen, I'm better in the air, but you are a Beast on the ground. I'll hit him high, you hit him low. What do you say, partner? Yes, sir. Hoorah! Hoorah. Jim, you stay inside till I get back! You warmed up these guns good, but I'm about to make them red hot. Jim's in the house. I'm trusting you, partner. Yeah. 
really good, bring it down, fit, uh. We're leaving. No. No? No. Come on. This is our home. Kim, you just don't understand. Don't understand what? That they're stealing our land and kidnapping our friends and doing God knows what else? Kim. Nick, your grandfather built this place. You really want to turn your back on that? All the times you talked about handing off the business to our daughter. Oh, I talked about handing off the business to our son. You've seen the ultrasound. It's a girl. Well, that was on a messy black and white TV screen. You know them things ain't reliable. Nick. Oh my god. Stop playing. Well, I love you. Me too. Well, deputy, looks like the Rye family's digging in. Hey, listen, if you need any air support, you give me a holler, okay? You and me, if you like Butch and Sundance. Nick, they both died at the end. <laughs> ah. Please take care of him. I can get it to you. for us to judge. Deliver them unto the waters. The cleansing begins tonight. to Eden. Not this one. Really? This one's not clean. You <gasps> mop the cleansing jaw. No, Joseph. <clears throat> you have to love them, John. Do not let your sin prevent that. Bring that one to me. Oh, no. It's not... What the hell? Despite all that you have done, you are not beyond salvation. You're not here by accident or by chance. You are here by the grace of God. Yeah. You've been given a gift. Now it remains to be seen whether you choose to embrace it or to cast it aside.
You will confess every sin you've ever committed, no matter how petty, no matter how small. I will pull from you. Then we'll see if you're worthy of atonement. If we just confess, if we confess right away, we'll be okay, right? No. No. You'll make it worse. Why? Because confession without pain isn't confession. You'll scream out your sin, then you'll wear it on your flesh before John peels it off for you. It's a beautiful thing. Peggy's. I'm taking booty puppy like I'm playing Monopoly. And show them no mercy. <laughs> Stay with me. Didn't go through all this trouble just to lose you now. If y'all enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. I will see y'all next time.